Have you guys ever heard of DJI? Here are some of my clips using their drone. You may know DJI for their drones, but in this video, they sent me a DJI Osmo Action 4 camera, which I'm going to be using and testing out. Enjoy. And if you guys don't want to watch the unboxing, skip to 6.30 for the travel or skip to 7.25 for the surfing. Yo, what's up guys? Um, welcome back to another video. Oh, um, DJI sent me a bunch of stuff and... Um, super grateful and we're gonna freaking open this stuff up and then we're gonna freaking go take it out um, I'm actually gonna take it out um, in the tellos so I'll probably see you guys in the tellos after I've unpacked all this stuff Ew. so first off they sent me like a, um, a board mount with one of the um, magnet attachments so I'm pretty keen to use that chuck that on one of my boards when it's like big and barreling and should look pretty sick they sent me a uh, diving accessory kit. Gonna be using that um, a lot when I'm going like snorkeling and stuff, so that'd be pretty sick. But yeah, it's super epic. Um, they sent me a floating case, which is ideal because I do not want to be losing that thing at all. So, And they actually sent me a um, ND filters kit. These are super good. <laughs> These are super good, depending on um, how bright it is outside or what you want to shoot and all that type of stuff. I've done, done enough research on these yet, but I'm definitely going to have a go and putting them on and trying out and seeing what looks good with them. And last but not least, I just got a Osmo Action 4. Um, so that is super sick, super keen to um, freaking use this camera, man. I know that's super clear and it's super better, um, like underwater compared to GoPros. Um, so I'm pretty keen to use that. Ew. And I'm actually pretty keen to open this up, so let's freaking open it and have a look what's inside. So we've got the accessories, we've got the Osmo Action 4 section, got the charging case um, with all the batteries, because this is like the adventure combo, so it comes with all the spare batteries, which is so mint, so you can do hours and hours on the end of filming. How's that? Three batteries right there, and they're all charged, so pretty sick. Oh, stickers. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Stickers. I've been missing these. I wasn't just in there for two months. And I've freaking missed these things so much. Hell good. We got a, we got an extendable pole. Dude, this thing is solid, eh? I think I've used one of these before, these are super sick. They go hell long. Holy selfie stick, this thing is so big. Really keen on that stuff. They're making some pretty high quality stuff. I got a Hero 11 now, I've been using a water housing. And I can't hear any audio when I'm surfing and stuff, so I'm probably gonna just switch to DJI. Like I got a free camera, and their stuff is mint, so. Here's the camera. Oh. Wow, this thing's sexy, dude. FOV, you can do 155 degrees. How nice does this thing look? Whoa. These things are super easy to open compared to the um, freaking GoPro ones, which is super sick. And yeah, I think it just, it's just like a more well thought out design than, than GoPro. I don't know what they're doing. I think they're just spending all their money on marketing. <laughs> And so they've got this like housing here, this like hard housing, super mint. It's like you just unclip it and then the camera just slides in. 
and then it's like a freaking rock housing. If you drop it, it doesn't really get damaged. Super mint. But um, yeah, I'm pretty keen to just use it. Like, look how easy this is to put this on. Like what? And it doesn't come off because you need to push these in the side. But yeah, they're super sick. Let's go use the camera in the Telo Islands. You. Have a go, these guys are oh, so this art oh, is insane. This is all painting. We were supposed to leave at 12.05 and now we're leaving at 5.45 a.m. Missing my connecting flight and then probably such a mission. But um we'll see how it goes. Hopefully we don't miss any other flights. You Flight attendant Jensen speaking. Make sure you guys stay right to the end and watch me get a couple sick barrels with a new camera. Just had a major f round. I had to. Uh, I got here late because my flight was delayed. Um, and then I missed this flight and then I had to get rescheduled. I got rescheduled to later and I think it might have been delayed again. But I don't really have to get there till at least like 7, 7 a.m. tomorrow morning. so. That's all right, but hopefully it's not delayed again because oh, I just want to get there, please.
I have to say, one of the best waves I've ever surfed in my life. And man, the ba some of those barrels today were just so beautiful. Like it was so good to be out there with such a good crew. Like we had six charter boats and like four resort boats and the crew was legends. Like all legends, no one snaking, no one dropping in, no one being dickheads and man, turns out for such a good day. It's only 3.15, 3.20. So I'm going to go smash some food and then paddle back out in the arvo. Let's go.